So you're not going to take my complaint right here. I'm going to take your complaint right on the side of the road, okay? Wow. So I'm gonna take how about the girl? Complaint. How about the girl who called because her boyfriend was beating her? Did you take her complaint okay, on the side not, of the road? We're not going to talk in circles. All right. So I'm you'll take other people's complaint. Right so as long as it's not against a police officer, you'll take a complaint anywhere, right? But when it's against a cop, you won't take the complaint. What's your name? It's Why like, man, do I don't know. Did he get your information? You got my first and last name. Did you get your number or anything? No. His wife has my number. Hey everybody, it's James Freeman. This video was recorded Thursday, February 18th, 2021 in Mesa, Arizona. It's James Freeman out here. We got Spit and Cobra and uh, Joe Cool. 911 call came in from a female who had been assaulted by her significant other. She had snuck outside to call the police and was pleading with them to hurry before he found her again. When the police arrive, the suspect is outside walking down the sidewalk. They order him to stop and he doesn't. At some point they used either a beanbag gun or a taser on him, but because I was late to the scene, I'm not sure which one they used. This could have been a video where Mesa police were simply commended for helping someone who was being beat on by someone stronger than them. Hey, Unfortunately, guys, the Mesa police up, insist on controlling hey, all of the narratives. Good. And so when there's a camera around that they can't control, up, man? they lose it. Yeah, I'm going over that way. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, uh, yeah, I know. I know the manager. If you, uh, what's that? The manager said I can be there. I've already talked to a lot of the people around here, so. Dude, I, I can't hear you. Just shut up and do your job, okay? I get. Mind your business. Immediately, he starts trying to tell me that he's gonna trespass me from the car wash. He couldn't just keep his mouth shut and be the hero that protected a woman from a violent yeah, man. The signs are he right. has to You're be a bully. I mean, they're just being ridiculous, so. What are you doing? I'm gonna go talk to the manager, see if he wants to arrest me. Are you serious? Yeah. What's your name? Officer Schwartz, man, number 183. All right. See if he wants me arrested? Mesa Police Department are some of the most petty child cops I have ever seen. If you go back and watch the video, you'll see that I never actually even set foot on the car wash property until he goes to ask if the car wash wants me arrested for being on the property. I decide to follow to see exactly what he says. Hey man, can, I'm, I'm gonna wash my car. Man, okay, so I can wash my car over here? Can I, sir, can I wash my car over here? No, you you solicited that. You bullied him into doing that. I work with him every single day. Can I wash my car over here, please, man? Can I please? Please, man. I mean, he's just bullying me and you know it. Can I please just wash my van? I mean, it's it's up to you. It's your property. Yeah. This is ridiculous, man. I'm asking you one more time. Are you refusing to provide- No, I'm, I'm, no, I'm calling my lawyer. That's fine. I need your name, your true, full name. And if I don't give it to you, then what? You'll be arrested. Okay. And those are the magic words right there. Do I legally have to give my ID right here as far as Arizona statute says? No. I don't legally have to give my ID unless I'm lawfully arrested. I wasn't lawfully arrested and even if the car wash manager told me to leave the property, I still have the opportunity to leave before being arrested or, or any legal action being taken. But in all my years of doing this, I have learned law doesn't matter. There is a gang of violent thugs out there that are willing to do violent things to you if you don't obey them. At the point where they threaten violence, you have two options. You either obey the bully who's threatening violence or you defend yourself against the bully. Every single time that I have allowed the bully to arrest me unlawfully, I have beat every single charge. But spending years fighting within their system to have charges dismissed isn't a win at all. They get paid through the whole thing. And they are never individually held accountable for their actions, even when a lawsuit settles. Thug Shores can arrest me right now with a guarantee that nothing bad will ever happen to him for it. 
he will never be held accountable for his unlawful actions in this lifetime. So I don't see allowing him to arrest me and beating the charges as a win here. What I see as a win is pointing out and showing you beyond a shadow of a doubt that these guys are not operating under the rule of law. They are operating under unlawful threats and violence. That's what we call a system of the guy with the biggest stick wins. So it would appear that Mesa police showed up to this call to stop someone from preying on the weak because only Mesa police are allowed to prey on the weak. In Arizona, you are required Yeah, you don't need to run your mouth. You, you already made your threat. 13 2412 requires you to provide your true full name when lawfully detained. Okay. You legally trespass. There are signs posted there. And I wasn't trespassing. I was there for I, business, and I, you know it. No, you weren't. You're, you're, you're fucked. You were filming us. You're fucked. So if you fail to provide it... Are you ready yet or no? Yeah. You ready? Yes, do you have All right. Name? What's that? What's your name? First letter of my first name is J. Second letter of my first name is A. I copy. Is he trespassing you? Yes. That's the solicitation of trespass. <clears throat> Third letter of my first name is M. Betsy, he went in there and solicited a trespass. You guys he bullied call. him. He I bullied him. him. I've worked with him several times. I've got several guys trespassing call charges. Mesa I've got a receipt from this place, too. Betsy, so. put the Mesa PD uh, number up, please. Let's see, what, what number are we on? Everybody call Mesa PD. Sorry? What number or letter are we on? Let them know that they're violating okay. people's rights. Okay, so that's three letters. So yeah. the fourth letter is going to be M. I'm sorry, the fourth letter is going to be E. That's a motherfucking tyrant and right And then, there. Uh, what are we on, the fifth letter now? Motherfucking tyrant right there. You gave me the fifth letter. Fifth letter being E. Yes, sir. J-A-M-M-E. So -M 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 -E. Oh, there's just one M. Sorry about that. J-A-M-E. And then, uh, let's see, what are we on, Everybody five now? Yeah. Going. Okay, so the fifth letter is going to be S. Yes, sir. Okay, so what do you got now? James. James? Yes, your last okay. name, sir. You need a last name? Do you need yes. a middle true, name? or True full name. Yeah, do you need a middle name then? Or? True full name. Okay, I, well, I mean, I, I'm not a lawyer, so can you explain? Your, your, your full given name, yes. Okay, so I should give you a middle name? Yes, true full name. Okay. I, I would say that fits. Cool. Like I said, I'm not a lawyer. I guess you are, though. So. I'm not a lawyer. I'm law enforcement. Oh, you're not? Okay. So I need a middle name for you? Is that right? Provide me your last name, sir. Just a last name? That's fine. I'll, I'll work sufficiently with Well, that. I mean, I don't want to break the law. Are you sure? I mean, if, if I need to give a middle name, I'll just give a middle name. Please provide me with your last name. Last name? So you don't want the middle name? Last name. Sir. Last name only? Yes. I just want to confirm you don't want my middle name so I don't yes, get in sir. trouble for false ID. Is that correct? You don't want my middle name? No, you're fine. Okay. So the uh, the first letter of my last name is S. The last letter of my last name is R. Um, the second to last letter of my last name is E. Uh, the... the Gosh, where are we at? We were what do we have? We never Provide me with your last name, sir. We were right uh, the here. second letter. He's soliciting a fucking we don't have the second letter yet, right? No, he's we don't have the second letter yet, right? right okay, so the second letter of my last name is P. Um, and then we've got the last two letters, right? Yeah. Okay, so it's going to be... He's soliciting a trespass. The next one is going to be R. Okay, what do we have now on the last name? Please give me your, your last name, sir. Well, I'm trying to figure out where we're at so I can make sure I give you the rest. You're trying to play games. I'm asking for your last name. A child could do it. I know everybody. I'm sorry? All I'm asking is for your last name. It's hard to hear you with the muzzle on your face. I'm required to wear it by policy, sir. I, it's hard to hear you though, so it's hard to understand. Um, so we got SP. I'm trying to look at it there. Okay, we have SPR. So it's going to be I. I is going to be after the R. And then uh, N. N is in. Okay, and then uh, uh, G. And uh, do you need any more? No, James Springer. You were here by trespass from this property. If you return to this property, you'll be arrested. Do you understand? Okay, and, and until I get a, a written notice from them. 
that you're a piece of shit and I can come on the property. Is that okay, right? That's between you and the manager. It's a civil yeah. matter. Yeah. Do you have any other questions? It is for a me? civil matter, isn't it? Between so, you and them, yes. Yeah, it sure and, is. Unless they choose to prosecute for the criminal. It sure is. Matter. And, and uh, so you walked up there because I was actually standing right here on the easement and the rocks, right? This is an easement. Yeah, it is. You're an idiot. This is their property. This is why trash they're, like they, you. They are required. This is why trash like you gets this gets is hurt. Public. It's public. He's definitely on a public it's easement. Public. You see those public utilities so you, right there? Me on you're an idiot. Onto the property. Yeah, I did. What follow you there? over there. What's that? What are you doing there? Uh, going to follow you. Okay. And ask him if I could wash my car. Okay. Oh, you're Tell right. me what happened. What's your name again? Officer Shores. Officer Shores, please, please, Officer please Shores. call the Mesa Police Department Officer right now. Officer Shores, everybody call Mesa PD. Please. please call the Mesa Police Department right now. Officer Shores, see, I'm standing right here on the on the public easement. Okay. You guys are ridiculous. Dude, Relax, man. I, know, but we're I never give you any problems, here. and you guys constantly give I'm, me. We're crap, trying to dude. be cool. All right? Be cool with me, then. We're trying to. We're dealing cool. with the guy over then walk here. Then I get it, and, and you're and, and he's a real. Right and I know what he did too. I got nothing. No problem with that, man. I got no problem with what you're doing with him. Because I know what he did. Respect goes both ways. Just right. be cool. We'll yeah, cool. but he went and, tr and asked okay. them to trespass me while I was standing here recording, man. All right. That's, well, again, I got no problem with what you're doing over here. I know what he did to his girl. Okay. He's a coward. I get it, man. Okay. I got no problem Fine. with that. But he You're went. Saying, but but the fire he, guys deal with the thing over there. I, right. I get that. But you okay. saw what he just did. He went and solicited. Oh, you're the sergeant. Yeah. Robertson, I, are you his supervisor? Yes. Man, yeah, come on. Hey, Can we go this, undo that? That's ridiculous, dude. Are you his supervisor? I am. Then this is the guy you need to put the complaint in. Yeah. Right? All right, can we do a formal complaint yeah, right here on the spot, please? Let's All right. Let's do it. Are we in the middle of an investigation? Or? Yeah, I'm, okay. in, I'm investigating something. All right, something. why don't you guys wait right here? We will. Let us deal with this gentleman first, yeah. and then we'll figure out what your problem is next, okay? Yes, is that Officer fair? Thomas Shores. I appreciate you being just cool and calm, Robertson. Well, what are we supposed to do? <laughs> up? Hey, if it, if it were always like this, I wouldn't have a problem with you guys right, ever. Yeah, chill here for a minute, all right? All right, what? So we're good, like right? This. Officer yeah. Thomas Shores is his name. All right, just chill here. I think we're gonna transport just want this you guys. Guy. You guys videotape what you want. Just do me a favor. Just give them some space. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, we we got got I always give you guys space. I would, see, interference, space. interference would be for me to physically get in the way of you actually doing what you need to do. Say you're about to walk up to a car to search it, and I'm standing in front of the door blocking you. That's interference. I, I mean, yeah. you know what I mean? Well, yeah. I, I, listen. I mean. There's more perspectives than just your perspective, and I'm right. There's the, perspective. there's the court's perspective, and there's the court's perspective, and that's the one that really matters. Of, and that's why we have courts, right? And that's right. why that's the one that really matters. So right. it's been played out again and again and again that's and again. That's a good one, though. We're three deep out here. On yeah, world, huh? yeah. We're and again, deep. and again, yeah. and again, I got no problem with anything you guys came out here to do. I appreciate that you did it, man. Yeah. You, we're talking about a, a female who needed help. James. What's his name? Uh, what's his name? Got hit a date. Oh. Officer Thomas Go. Shore makes seventy-seven thousand dollars a year. Uh, officer, what is it? Uh, I just got Officer Height. Uh, height. Officer Height. Before that, I was in uh, Jay. Colorado. Before that, uh, Throw hands, Jay James. Jay Height, Betsy. Find out what he makes a year. What are you making a year? Base salary, I guess. Uh, base salary. Around sixty. Okay. You do a lot of overtime. Right. Yeah. Uh, it'll it'll yeah. tell me here Sometimes. in a minute. All right. Probably uh, 70 then maybe. I'm not, I'm not lying. Very, about 60. That sounds about right for Mesa. Yeah. How long have you been with him? Yeah, I'm a lateral officer. I'm not originally from Mesa. Yeah. Officer Tommy what does that mean? Makes yeah. so I'm, not, uh, I'm not a... I know, right? Uh, I like the weather. Mesa, know, Arizona, uh, higher. Okay. Control. As far as going through the academy uh, and everything like that. Yeah. Right? He's, he's good, man. He's good. He's on the public sidewalk. He's not interfering. Please leave him alone. Please, please, please. I didn't know that they were moving. Yeah, yeah. So I was just making sure that... Come on, man. I know Dude, we're, I we're professionals at... Oh, you, guys, you guys tell me how to do my job. Yeah. <laughs> that's the thing is I don't come up here. I'm not coming up here and saying... I'm going to come to your job and tell you how to do... That's the thing. His job is to record. something that's not right... Put my motherfucking ass in cuffs. Hey, man. <laughs> but the thing is, his job is to record. We didn't come up and say, hey, man, you shouldn't have beanbagged him. Hey, man, you shouldn't have tased him. You know, we didn't do that. I'm not telling you. Right. And we're not telling you how to do it. We're just recording. Listen, so just like in your day to day, right? Are you perfect in everything that you do? Oh, hell no. Are you perfect in everything you do? Yes. Just everything. ask my wife, everything. man. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> Unless Never. you ask my wife. Okay. So there, there's some there's some room for growth and you know to to 
grow as a person so that we all can coexist in this world, right? Yeah. We all have work to do. Work yeah. Right? I'm totally aware of but that's the thing. I won't tell you what to do, and I got to be able to get the shots, though. No, no, he's, he's getting transported. As long as you can film right here. Yeah. He's getting transported. Yeah. He's gonna go he's to the hospital. He's gonna go get checked out. I yeah. Um, I'm standing at work. He's got some medical yeah. issues because he was beating his Call girl. You. Check it out. That's fun. Knock yourselves out. <laughs> <laughs> we got Joe Cool out here, by the way, guys. Joe Cool, right here. I would have been here actually. Is that your street name now, Joe Cool. Yeah. What's your? What's he your really handle? is cool, though. Is what's it? your handle? I don't. I don't really go by one. What do you on have, on, on you, Tinder I do and on or not Tinder uh, Grinder the gay site, right? but not on hey, your decisions is your own. Decisions <laughs> I'm just man. kidding, dude. What is uh like? What are you? I don't really go by one. I just roll around, man. And so it's like Mesa Cop Watch. No, no, I don't really. I don't really go I mean, by I'll, a handle. I'll end up finding it. I just want to know if just make it easier. Yeah. I've been very open yeah. and honest. With no, you. I know, but I don't want to brag about like, oh, I have a YouTube or a curious. Facebook or a, to, or a everybody's always trying to get subscribers on their Insta. You know what I mean? I'll find it later. Cool. Yeah, it's all public, man. I just. So he just, so I do need to do the uh, official, I got to do the official yeah. complaint with uh, Sarge. Guys, don't be mistaken by the casual conversation here either. These cops are still being overly controlling. Even during the conversation, you saw that he tried to give Spit and Cobra arbitrary orders about where he can and can't be while he's recording. So long as you're not interfering with what's going on, you can be anywhere. The police have no legal or lawful right to dictate where you can or can't be so long as you're not interfering. Furthermore, the sergeant said that he would take my complaint against his officer, but you're about to see how disingenuine that was. He couldn't care less, but he's very polite in his way that he blows me off. So we got to do an official complaint, right? What's that? He says there's no trespass charge. He just wanted you to move. It doesn't matter. I, and that's the, what the complaint is about. He's got no business doing that. Okay. You know, I am a patron of this business. And it was just a bullying tactic because I'm recording it. Because I'm recording what's going on here. Okay. You know, and so he had no legal grounds to stop me from recording. And so he tried to bully me that way. And really, man, I've got it all on recording, too. He was intimidating this dude right here. This dude was like, oh, man, I don't know. I don't, he was really uncomfortable Jay about... Cool. This guy right here, yeah. is he like the manager or something? I, he was who, that was who he asked if he could trespass me. And the guy was real uncomfortable about it. like, man, do I don't know. Did he get your information? He got my first and last name. Did you get your number or anything? No. His wife has my number. I'm just kidding, dude. I'm just kidding. I'm Come sorry. On, I'm man. sorry. Go back to professional, James. To cool I know, you, I know, I know. Come on, that was a little bit funny. It's yeah, just a joke. Just no, a joke. Because we're trying to get on the same page here, you know? Cool. I just talked to the property manager about something else. Yeah. yeah. But just to get clarification, where is their property start and stop? Their property line stops at the sidewalk. Well, it doesn't. He's wrong. No, it doesn't. That He's sign right there stupid. is, uh, that's public right there. So, so, so that, right here is and you see where, yeah. yes. This yeah. is no passing. Right. So the city can't put signs on private property. So they have Unless to put it on a public easement. I, listen. No, so you can see where the utilities are at also. Those don't go on the public messenger. property. I wanted to get clarification uh -huh. for everybody's betterment. Uh -huh. The business, as far as they've been told, their property line yeah, stops do, at this, the they, sidewalk. They take care of this vegetation because the city surely does not. I guarantee uh -huh. you, the city's not so, watering these trees so and I'm, trimming these bushes. Let me explain we're something to you. To, we're just trying yeah. to make sense yeah. out of everything. I get So I, I lived in Texas for a while, and we had a sidewalk, that, uh, and we had the gore area. You know what I'm talking about? You got a street, and then you got grass, and then you got a sidewalk, and then you got my yard. My property line went all the way to the curb, okay. but I had zero right to trespass people from the sidewalk or the gore area. Okay. Even though I took care I of it, I, I cut the grass. The city is not taking care of I know that. Ingress I, I get that. And that's what I'm telling you is that I... The property I, owner is taking care of the That's what I'm telling you is that I was required to take care of public that. property. But it, and, and I still had to, to allow people access to it. Okay. Well, so, okay. That's the way that this stuff works. Well, check that. You know what I'm saying, Jay Cool? 
is See, you that, know. that is a Texas ordinance. <laughs> well, it public property is public property. Okay. Texas, so whatever and I, they define and I, private property or public property differs. From well, I did 20 years in Arizona, so I know it's the same way. Okay. Well, as far as we can pull up maps and grids and find yeah. out if we need to, yeah, which we're is not just gonna silly, to do that. right? We're not going to try just to play silly. the silly game. Now, what a person to is asked the property's the business. Property, they have no trespassing signs the over the property. property. Uh huh. And I'm going to end it with this, and we're going to go no further. And and so he wants me trespassed still. Is that right? He's saying that. So he doesn't want my business. He doesn't want your business. Okay, what's the name of the business? Rinse and Ride Car Wash. Rinse and Ride Car Wash. In in, uh, Mesa, Arizona, on Country Club. Okay, we'll get that. Yeah. I'm I'm going to end it here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So just so we're clear, as far as the business is concerned, their property line stops at the sidewalks. But you're gonna be, you're gonna do the right thing and, and realize that the city of Mesa literally has their property right there, and that the the public utilities is where we're gonna put the line. We're talking in circles. Here. Yeah, we're gonna be reasonable and put the line where the public uh, utilities are. My name. Well, I still need to do the official complaint. Too. I know. And okay. We'll, we're gonna take. I'm not gonna take it right in that pocket right there. I'm not gonna take it right out here on the side. We're dealing with a whole bunch of stuff. Well, yeah, you can deal with this. We're gonna meet separate. We're gonna take, and I'll take your complaint. We're meeting right here. I'm not gonna sit here with all these people and. Do you want to go over here with we're just not me record alone? It. I'm gonna be with you. No, we're gonna we're record I'm, it. I'm in the middle of a call. We're not gonna record it. Right now, it. I'm not gonna stop what I'm doing. Oh, Sarge, do come on! You were yeah. doing good earlier, Robertson. I'm Look, still man. with you. Hey, hey why don't you guys give me a card? I might see you while I'm out here. So you're not gonna take my card. complaint right here. I'm right gonna take your you complaint right on the side of the road, okay? Wow. So I'm gonna take how about the girl? Complaint. How about the girl who called because her boyfriend was beating her? Did you take her complaint okay, on the side not, of the road? We're not gonna talk in circles. All right. So we're you'll take other people's complaint. Right so as long as it's not against a police officer, you'll take a complaint anywhere, right? But when it's against a cop, you won't take the complaint. What's your name? James. James what? Springer. S P R I N G E R. That's correct. What's your phone number? Are you live? Let me, I'm going to give him my phone number real quick. So I gave you my real number. You know, I'm trying to communicate with you. I wouldn't, I don't yeah, give no, my cell phone number to just it. anybody. We're, dude, we're on the same page. Okay. Okay, we're on the same page. All right. I'm going to deal with this. We're on the same page. We're not going to do it right out here with all these guys and do the stuff live broadcast. Well, we're going to. cell phone. I'm going over to the other scene. Okay. And we're going to take this. And I'm going to contact you and we're going to do this. You got my name, yeah. my phone number. I got your name, your phone number. We're going to do this. Okay. Can, in okay. the meantime, can you I just talk to my officer also? I'm going to have to follow up with this business owner. And in the meantime, you're saying you don't want to be trespassed or you felt, you felt that he was trespassing you, right? They, well, you you the, felt that he didn't have a, a reason to trespass you? Well, it was more that he wouldn't have done it if the officer didn't tell him okay. to. He felt bullied by the cop. And I'm just asking, you know, I'm just asking that they stop doing that. You know, if it, I get it, I, I own private property and I also own businesses. You know, if I come to the police and I want someone trespassed, I expect them to be trespassed. Well, but man, just, just it's, work, we'll work with you guys. But it's unreasonable us. for the police to come to me and say, hey man, I got a guy out here that's annoying to me. Will you please you trespass him? Work with us, we're going to work with you guys. We know you guys are out here, you're filming. And there's different just guys too. There's different guys. Exactly, just like the man. cops, some of them are assholes and some exactly. of them aren't. But you know okay. what? Me and you on a one on one basis should not be having problems. And, and I hope to not have any problems with your officers doing what the doing what he just exactly. did anymore. We need to work together. All right. We'll, all right. we'll get through this. All right. Okay. All right. Just Fair ask them not to trespass, not to solicit the trespass. Hey, if the business wants me gone, they can come to you, right? Yeah. That yeah. I think that sounds fair and reasonable. Have all a right. good one. All right, buddy. Uh, Joe Cool. Very good. All right, fellas. See you guys. Be good. All right. I shall see you right. for the next ten years. <laughs> Call the Mesa Police there, Department, sorry. please, guys. Uh, let me go get the information from this business as well. If you guys want to contact them and let them know what you think about uh, working with the police and bullying people who are just trying to document what's going on. Matters of public, uh, matters of uh, public interest. So this is a car wash. We are at the corner of Country Club in Hampton. And... Uh, it's Rinse and Ride Car Wash, Country Club and Hampton in Mesa, Arizona.